Namaste. Hello, my dear beautiful Capricorn. How are you all doing today? I welcome you all to your channel. This is your host Shivangsh. Those who are new to my channel, thank you so very much for tuning in. And uh, this is going to be Capricorn, your love energy check. And if I am doing this for Capricorn, this is strongly pertaining to uh, Earth element. All right, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn or capricorn this has a like kind of a strong placement of moon energy in capricorn all right that's how i'm feeling because a lot taking place in the house of capricorn right now and with the lord of karma all right <laughs> yeah i shuffled and shuffled and shuffled this two come card came 47 and 44 that's adds up to 11 and that's 44 11 44 so capricorn you are in a thinking mode right now in your 3d existence like what do i do about my emotion in spirit so in spirit you're trying to find a balance with your emotion and in 3d world you are thinking about that how do i make a move ahead where i just say goodbye to my old self and try to create something new for myself all right that's how i am feeling and there is this big energy shift is taking place in your life that's how i'm feeling capricorn a big energy shift is taking place in your life and i'm seeing that somebody is seeing you as a beautiful queen all right queen of chastity sorry for the interruption i got a call all right and i had no idea who called me so i had to pick up and uh, that's my maid so i'm feeling like uh, some kind of good news is coming your way because when this call came i stopped and this is the place where i was shuffling that's the ten of pentacles and while i was shuffling i actually intended to pull up cards for the masculine energy because this is i'm highly feeling as like your uh, spiritual energy and uh, 3d energy so thinking woman with the card number 47 you are in 3d is in thinking mode all right and as far as your emotions are concerned you are uh, working as a woman holding a heart all right woman holding a heart means you are uh, trying to find a balance something fell down or fell down there and up there in in that other flat so loud noise all right so this is uh, in emotional space there's a lot of trouble going on uh, where you are not able to find that peace and in the 3d when you are like in your consciousness trying to understand like what is it that is stopping me and what can i do to come out of it that's your spirit energy and 3d energy however you know when i was thinking about pulling up card for the masculine energy i found that uh, 10 of cups all right i stopped there and i received a call so it may be so that there are certain things that is there close to your chest you want to speak up but you are not able to all right and uh, and i'm feeling like a much awaited communication is going to come about a conflict that has taken place in the past look at that it cannot be a coincidence that from two different deck there is this queen of cups all right that means this person is now seeing their bs towards a beautiful queen and they really want to heal that with the ten of cups because they are seeing in two different places they are saying that you are a wonderful queen all right and they in their 3d they are having this conflict in their mental space uh, mental space like what do i do should i go forward and speak my truth should i listen to my intuition you know i see this person as a whole package for me what do i do what not they are struggling between their head and heart this person is having a lot of struggle between their head and heart all right and they really have no clue and idea as to like what do i do because at the end of the day this person look they want to do so much all right take ownership of their actions because they see how beautiful you are and if they don't speak their heart out they will continue to feel that burden of not speaking the truth what happens when you lie and you don't speak the truth what happens is that when you don't speak your truth and you you have lied you know your 
your conscience, your consciousness is telling that you have done injustice to a wonderful queen. You had created, um, you know, forcefully, intentionally you created some, I feel like that this person has created certain thing intentionally just to run away from your life. And when they try to run away from your life, because look, this person fought with you intentionally, hurt you intentionally and they wanted to run away because they were feeling this connection burdensome they were feeling really really burdensome with this connection about how they are feeling and they had no option but to just run away when they try to run away they did not realize knowingly or unknowingly they have done a wrong karma they did not speak their truth they were stuck without uh, uh, as in like i don't know what to say or how to handle like the way you felt like about this connection or oh, I never felt anything like this before. The same way this person also felt about this connection. This connection from the day one had a very, very strong grip of emotions within both of you. Because both of you have got that emotional uh, energy that is Queen of Cups and Queen of Cups from two different decks. And both of you have been putting in that effort to understand this connection for what it is which has brought conflicting energies to you and which has brought um you know this heavy some energies to you too to both of you this is like kind of if this is you my viewer this energy is for both of you this energy is also for both of you all right both of you are not uh, has not paid in attention to the red flags to the intuitions that were nudging at the first place all right and that's when you both landed up having that conflict, that argument with each other, then running away from this connection. When you guys fell apart in separation and uh, through the time of waiting and perseverance, seven of uh, pentacles, you both have come to this realization of the beauty of this connection because a thinking woman has a butterfly out here all right you can see there is this butterfly this thinking woman with the butterfly around this person is getting enlightenment and understanding about their emotions and so do they they are also understanding what is making them burdensome all right they are listening to their intuition and you are also listening to the intuition because of the current planetary transits because guru you know, Capricorn. Guru is playing a big role right now and teaching you enlightenment lessons and that's what you are getting and you are just on point with your intuition and so do they. And they are, now you are also understanding where, what went, uh, what went wrong and how and what I, what I need to do now in this connection and that's what you are doing because this person understands that walking out of your life uh, it has created in a way a place for them where there is nothing left out for them except for burden, except for this cry, this internal conflict, all right? And they are like kind of cursing themselves, like why I did not listen to my intuition before, why I had to play with such a wonderful queen, all right? You might have said something to this person that sometimes karma returns, my dear, don't play. This person did not listen and now they are regretting and that's the reason of this uh, conflict within them because now they don't know how to fix and even if they know how to fix it is too much of a burden to come to you and confess and when you resist something and then you don't do uh, as per your heart says then what you are calling out tower for yourself right you are calling out tower for yourself at the end what you will do you will continue to wait look at that i said you are going to wait 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 then tower this person is calling tower only for only for them to see what they have left behind this tower is revealing your truth to them i'm telling you three four queens back to back you know because this queen really has experienced something unimaginable for this queen whoever this person is who has put in uh, stood through all uh, through the adverse situation through thick and thin through tower moments through conflict through burden through knowledge and perseverance the way you have turned out to be 
by listening to your intuition following the nudge from the universe when you have seen your truth and you're vibrating with vibrating with this energy this person is more staying in that energy of like I don't know how to make that move. They are having that tower within themselves. Yeah. A tower of knowledge has given you the understanding of who you are. And you are on the right path with this guru with you. Who is giving you the guidance. Walk this path. And you will be there where you will find that emotional fulfillment. You are vibrating in this energy. When you are vibrating in this energy, this masculine, look, no coincidence, this masculine energy, right? This is all masculine energy, you see. Okay? And these are all feminine energy. Very soothing, very grounded, very calm and comforting. All right? Your life was deemed and now this person is going to, uh, you know, do something that will give you uh, some kind of healing. The way this person has wounded your heart, God has wounded their heart at the same time with tower experiences, burdensome energies, stuck energies, conflicting energies. This person probably had uh, conflicts with everybody around them. Yeah, that's how I'm feeling. They forgot to even talk properly with others. That's how I'm feeling. And, uh, and, and universe is asking me to let you know that your life is about to make a move. All right, because... Look at that, five, six, seven is about to move towards emotional fulfillment after this dark night of the soul journey that you have gone through, all right? Ace of Cup is uh, rewarded, is, is a awaiting reward for you, uh, awaiting for you. This person will come back, I'm telling you, this person will come back the way they, they have done, like back and forth into your life, all right? with toxic energies and has put you in this energy where you're going through ripple effects in your life and not able to move feeling doomed curse and like financially financially career wise also you felt like i'm not stable anymore and and you are now understanding like what happened to me and why and you have taken those necessary precautionary moves and you have radiated the same energy to the masculine of your life and this is where they are at dealing with their darkest hours of night only to come and see that how beautiful you are and there is nothing lacking in you all right that they need to run away from and they really really desperately want to make that move but they really have no idea or clue whatsoever whether how can how they can make that move <laughs> look at that this is the blank card came out which is the energy of nothingness going god is going to bring them into that nothingness energy and in that nothingness energy they will be turning out into a blank slate of themselves where universe will now write what exactly you should be doing and and this person will follow the nudge all right this person will absolutely follow the nudge and that nudge will be come on you know do justice you know, get back to your passion, not in that gaming way. Be in your power. Be that authentic self. And that's when this person, finally a wonderful king has showed up. Its presence, which, which is very much grounded emotionally also and financially also. And you are a queen who is very much grounded in her own, every essence and every elements and every aspect because of um, of this card present out here. All right. And this king is seeing this. This king is not at, not yet vibrating in that energy of emperor, all right? Not yet. But uh, you are going to make them a lot of understanding and that's what I'm feeling. And this is the connecting energy for both of you to bring that emotional healing because both of you need emotional healing, right? Because both of you have experienced a tower, all right? So you also need healing. They also need healing. You understand that God needs to do justice to me. They also know that I need to do justice, all right? So before I do ask for justice, um, before I can free myself from this burdensome energy or paranoia nights, I have to do justice to somebody that I have wrong in the past and I have to make every wrong right, all right? So I am now seeing the possibilities lies ahead with you, which is helping me stop rehashing the past anymore to whatever i said they are seeing of who you are and they are willing to somebody has played a song you know somebody has played a romantic song so i'm telling you while i'm talking about this somebody has loudly played that song and 
this is my neighbors all right they understand that they know that i do my work they hear and knowingly they intentionally play this all right i'm like okay you know this is a beautiful song playing on mera dil hai dil all right so getting ready to match your vibration and frequency i don't want to disappoint you this time around to whatever i said it is just validating wow getting ready to match your vibration this king is now trying to be that emperor to match up with her frequency right this is the highest degree of re, uh, of the energy that i can see getting ready to match your vibration and frequency i don't want to disappoint you this time around they really don't want to disappoint you the way they have disappointed you in the past all right i am now seeing the possibilities lies ahead with you which is helping me stop rehashing the past anymore and move towards you so they they see that who you are and they are seeing the possibilities with you they are getting those higher knowledge and wisdom all right through tower experiences and the enlightenment that is coming towards them that is helping them see that the possibilities that you carry and with you how world will look like and that's the reason they are willing to take every chance to actually uh willing to take chance to actually come forward and take that risk of talking out there's truth because now they are getting into that uh, nothingness all right nothingness means they are connecting to their soul essence now where they are understanding they are regretting they are guilt feeling guilty and they are coming out of that now because they don't want to be in that energy anymore or continue to fight with this anymore and they know that they have to speak their truth and here you go finally he showed up i really intended to close this reading but look this emperor is coming towards his empress to speak their truth this is the ultimate risk that they are going to take in their life and they know that is why they are getting freaked out even this thought is giving them tower and burden and then conflict because they know capricorn they really was they did dirty to you they really know that they have done dirty to you they cannot mess with your energy anymore and in order to come towards you the only possibility is speak their truth and rest their case in your hands and see what exactly you can do or else they will continue to be fighting with themselves with this paranoia nights for the rest of their life and they understand that they understand that somebody is waiting somebody is really really waiting for them and they need to do justice somebody is feeling really really defeated burden and they are understanding and they are getting that intuition now that they need to do justice they need to come forward and take charge and take accountability for whatever they have done and that's what they are doing and that's a good energy to come my dear all right that's a really really a good energy to come so i see that this queen of cup is going to be rewarded very soon this queen of cup is going to be rewarded very soon all right and this reward will change your life forever once and for all all right and so do they the day you will come in this energy to whatever i am saying you will feel it in your bones everything you will see that wow this is amazing all right i was not expecting this energy this is playing a wonderful uh, this is a wonderful sign for me i'm really sorry for the noise that you can hear around okay this is the emotional energy of yours when i was doing other reading that was fine but now only the sound has increased it's like yeah through chaos only you will find that peace and that peace is coming towards you to restore your emotional space all right both of you okay so i hope and uh, this messages has helped you in some way shape or form until we meet again i'm sending across much love and light to you all om namah shivaya stay blessed and in peace bye bye